Hey, I'm Jason Adair, Reg hey, I'm Jason Adair Regional Sales Manager at Braun Ambulances. I'm here to show you uh, the Chevy 5500 um, Liberty, 72 inch headroom, 156 inch box. Uh, something new that we wanted to bring to you guys and show you uh, for FDIC, uh, booth 4639, uh, Braun Industries booth. Uh, so we'll go around, you can see on the front, we have this camera here. This is part of our Brigade 360. Uh, it, it's a 360 camera, we'll show you more once we get inside. Once you come inside, you can see that this this is uh, equipped with liquid springs. Um, you can see the suspension controller down here. Uh, you can see our standard console layout. Um, you can see the Brigade 360. We did place that in place of the mirror. Um, up there, you can see on the right side there is where you could get a full 360 around your vehicle. Um, the other way that this works is you turn your left blinker on. You can see what's coming on the left side. You turn your right blink blinker on, it goes on the right side. Uh, so it's a really good camera system uh, to be able to see all the way around your truck. Um, I also want to show you our backlit console. Uh, so we have done some things with our backlit console. We can get different colors if need be. We can move those around. Uh, but that is something new that we, that we have to show you guys as far as consoles here at Braun. The cup holders are illuminated as well. And so is the map box storage in the back. As you can see, this is a crew cab um, on our Liberty models. We can put extended cab or crew cabs on the Liberty or the Express Plus. Um, so definitely if you're, you're looking for some lockers or something in the back or maybe you have a lot of people riding, um, definitely look at us for a Liberty or an Express Plus. We can definitely um, accommodate any of your needs. So we're just going to continue on with the tour of the box back here. Uh, go to OSS number one. We have another Easy O2 lift. Uh, you know, great, great back saver for you guys. Yeah, Works real easy. Basically just pull down the yellow handle, uh, stand on it. You can fit an H or an M tank, change out your bottle, put your bottle back on, uh, and then lift it back up, hook everything up, hook your regulators up, everything like that. Um, you also have a little bit of storage in the back uh, for, for some smaller things if need be. OSS number two, this is a demo. This truck is for sale. Uh, so if you do want anything, get a hold of me, get a hold of anybody at Braun. Uh, we can definitely you know, get this in with you guys. So in here, there's just additional storage for whatever you guys may want. Um, you can put whatever you want in here. This is an adjustable shelf, so you can move it up or down. Uh, give you some storage here in this compartment. OSS number three, once again, um, a lot of big storage in here for you. Um, it's outside access only cabinet for you guys. Uh, this is our gator hide in here that we use on all of our exterior compartments. Uh, long lasting, uh, nice and sticky so your stuff doesn't slide around. We do also have uh, the lights on the back of all the doors. Um, that way if you're in traffic or anything, nice safety feature for you guys. So on the back, I just wanted to shut the doors here because we do have the uh, the, the strip lights here um, that, that will go with your chevrons if you didn't want to put chevrons on. Uh, they can work as a third brake, uh, just more emergency lights, whatever you may want to do. Uh, we can do uh, four or five, we can do three, whatever you may want to do on the back of this truck. Uh, so I just wanted to kind of show you the back. You can also see the rear view camera, Brigade 360, so that, that goes along with the system as well. Come over here to OSS number four. In OSS number four, uh, this is basically for your backboards, scoops, things like that inside this compartment. You got your strap here. Um, there's also some other things we can put in here. It's totally up to what you guys want to do. Uh, if we need to add anything or something like that, we could do that as well. Anything? Next, I'm going to show you the sliding door. Uh, so on the sliding door. Uh, same as the last truck that I had, this is something we've been doing for 18 years. Um, so we have a lot of references on these sliding doors. Very good safety feature. Getting out of the truck, you can see both ways. Um, instead of having a hinge door where you can't see getting into traffic, if you parked into a tight space, you can actually park in that tight space and still be able to get out of your truck. Uh, gives you good lighting when you come out automatically uh, for your scene lights. And then uh, we'll go in here to uh, OSS number five. Uh, your ALS cabinet, once again, you can see the lights on the back of the doors. Uh, just another safety feature for you guys. You can see all your shelves up here. Uh, a lot of people put their bags in here, um, your ALS, BLS bags. Um, down here is additional storage. If for some reason we needed more power for something, we could put a battery tray down in there for you as well. If you look inside the curved step well, we have our, our oxygen holders here. Um, so you guys can put them there. It's just a nice space, uh, space saver for you guys uh, to keep them right here. Pretty easy to get to from the inside of the truck.
we don't frame glass. So. Come on the inside of the truck. We'll start on the curbside where you can see the squad bench. You got a nice big bench uh, to work off of here. Um, you got your EBS contoured backpack, back seats, not backpack. Uh, but you can see the contours on the seats here. Um, and then you can see our embroidery in the head pads. Uh, we did do the bronze, uh, but we could put your logo in here if need be. Um, anything that you guys may want. Um, inside of here as well, I'll go to the attendant seat right here. Right here. Um, we have the, the uh, EBS back form seat. Um, got the molding in it as well with the name. Uh, nice nice four-point harness here. Uh, just added safety on the inside. Uh, you got your Pro Air uh, 3856 air conditioner. Um, you have additional storage up here uh, for whatever you guys may want to use or put in here, linens, um, whatever you guys may want. Um, these is just your stack for the inside of where your bags would usually sit or whatever you want to keep on the inside. So we'll go to the curbside of this unit. All these are flip up restocking frames. Uh, so you can see all the flip up restocking frames. I'm going to turn on some of these lights through our Vista screen. So if you kind of want to see how it works, um, I'll turn on some of these lights so you can see. Turn on some dome lights. You've got we got the white blue dome lights. So if you want the white, we got the white. Uh, if you want blue, we got blue. So you got your checkout lights. So you get a lot of lighting in here uh, if you're running IVs or anything like that. Uh, you got your attendant light here. It goes to red or white, just whichever color you want to do. You can come in here as well to your cabinet lights. So we do have all the LED strip lights in here that are blue in color. We can definitely get those in any color that we may need to get. Uh, another unique feature in this truck, as you can see down here, we got our mirrored stainless um, that runs next to the cot here. Uh, we can do that in, in, in mirrored or, or brushed, um, whichever you prefer. Uh, but like I said, all these cabinets up here are all restocking frames, so really easy to get in and out of um, and, and restock your guys' frames for the next crew coming in. Um, even, even these ones here, same same thing here. You got your, your cabinets here that go up and down, um, really easy to load in and out. Um, you got your cabinet here. I know in the last truck they was putting linens in here, but it's definitely for whatever you want to use that for, this storage here. Um, the next unique feature I want to show you guys on this truck is the actual air curtain on the rear. So this system right here is actually an air curtain. So it's similar to a similar to a uh, department store or something where you have the air curtain come down uh, and, and it keeps that air conditioning in. So when this air conditioner is on in this truck, you can come back here and you can hit this air curtain and the air's coming out right now. So anything, when I open these rear doors, it's keeping that heat on the inside of this truck. Uh, we did make it to where if you pull a patient out, you can't touch, shut that off um, and then turn it right back on as soon as you get them out so that doesn't affect their face or anything like that. Uh, but it is definitely a unique feature that we have in this rear head pad. Uh, we can do that on every unit. Just, uh, you know, just ask for ask us for the air curtain. Um, we can definitely get you some information on it um, and, how, and how we do that. But it's definitely a, a saver for any hot climates uh, that you may be in uh, down south that, that you want to keep the air in inside your truck. Um, I also want to show you underneath the squad bench as well. You've seen this big place here. You actually have a big storage compartment underneath your squad bench as well. So you can keep anything that you want under the squad bench. Over here is going to be your sharps and trash area. We just don't have the bins in uh, for the shelf. This thing's actually equipped. I know you keep looking at the floor on these, this thing, uh, but there's no there's no cot hardware or anything on this floor. It is a demo truck, so we could we could accommodate any cot hardware you would need, whether it be Ferno, Striker, whatever it needs to be. Um, up above, you see that we have the 96 inch grab rail here on my left, and then the 64 inch grab rail right here on the right. We got our oxygen outlet in the center of the ceiling, and we have two of our recessed CPI um, uh, IV hangers. Uh, so you can see that we've equipped this with oxygen on each side as well uh, for easy use for you guys in the back. And then you, we got the grab rails here in case you do have to unbuckle and be up here to be able to hold these. Um, I appreciate you guys, you know, checking out this video. Uh, please stop by our booth here at Braun Industries. We're going to be at FDIC till Saturday at two o'clock. We'd love to see you. We got plenty of reps from uh, the whole United States of our dealer network. A lot of great people that would love to talk to you. Love to see you. Um, Come by if you're a customer and say hello, and uh, if not, come by and see see what makes us Braun strong. So.